I need to hide. This creature haunts me. My name is Herod Bishop, and I will tell you my horrible story. This story happened to me in the late 70s, and even the most terrible nightmare will seem only echoes of horror in comparison with those mysterious events which I participated in. I worked as a real estate agent, and we had an old mansion in Maine which no one could sell. It was a dead weight in our company as a stale product on the store's shelf, which was losing its value every day. After all, houses also have a shelf life. And then, one May morning, the silence of our office on the Fifth Avenue was broken by a telephone call. That call changed my whole life. It was a Mr. Johnson, a very strange client, who was willing to seize this old junk called house. And even the fact that a family of five people disappeared in this house did not frighten him. But on the contrary, it was the reason for such a strange purchase. After a brief conversation, my boss decided to send me to Stonebridge, to this provincial hall in Maine. My task was to inspect the house and make sure that it still didn't fall apart, and then to contact the client for a deal. My name is Henry Bishop. I will tell you my horrible story. are real bones. How can I get out of this place?
will be the last on your journey.
Cero, cero, I wake up, Alicia. Is it she? Did I make it? <clears throat> Ah, Robert? Alicia, you're back. I've tried so many years, and finally I've managed to get you back. Robert, you got so old. Why, why do I have a male body? I performed the ritual over women. But they were all weak. Only his body was strong. Only he could go through the ritual to the end. The main thing is that you're alive. Oh, Robert. Where are our parents? They died many years ago. The main thing is that now we are together. So many things have changed in the world. I have so much to tell you. Francis, we have to go. 